how do we get out of feeling controlled by unsolicited advice? And it doesn't matter if you're an individual or if you're an organization, it can start to feel the same way, like somebody else is coming in and attempting to steer your ship. And you need to take the helm back in many ways, but do you do it forcefully? Or is there a kind, compassionate way to do it? And I would offer there is a kind and compassionate way to do it. And if you have to, then there's an assertive way. But assert- being assertive is different than being aggressive. And we talk about this all the time. You don't have to be aggressive, but you can assert your boundary and let individuals know no, this is not how it works in my world. And so I'm taking the wheel back. I appreciate where you're coming from, but no, that's not how it happens here. It's the same in our everyday life. If, and I'm going to use my dad, my dad is an amazing human being. I'm using him because he's an amazing human being and he's going to know that this is not directed at him. But if my dad comes to me and gives me unsolicited advice about our relationship, and I'm using our relationship because it's solid and nothing is ever going to derail that. And he tells me, you need to do this in your relationship. And I tell him, thank you, dad, for your advice. But I feel things are very solid between Austin and I. And I don't feel that applies right now. And then he comes back again and he comes back again and he comes back again. And each time I tell him the same thing, I appreciate the advice. I don't feel that it is relative to where we are right now. If it doesn't stop, then at some point, that's where I need to be assertive, right? So I've been loving, but the communication is not being received. So now I need to be assertive and say, Dad, my relationship with Austin is my relationship with Austin. I've heard you. I've explained to you that it is where we desire it to be. And so please do not approach me with this again. And if you do, I will walk away. I will not engage in this conversation anymore. So he knows clearly that my boundary is, if you bring this up again, I'm going to walk away from you. The next time, should he bring it up again, I need to disengage and completely walk away and not hear him again. And the more I continually do that and I walk away from him every time he brings it up, then he knows that that advice is not something I'm willing to receive anymore. Right. Right. Absolutely. I mean, and another way also that's assertive is to um, mirror, right? Like, hey, I've, I've brought up multiple times that where we're at is good, but I've noticed you brought this up multiple times. Are you sure this is for me? Or is there something going on in your life that we can walk through? You know, that this, this actually may be very valuable advice for yourself, right? Also assertive. Mm-hmm. It's being, it's holding your boundary, saying, nope, I'm good. This is, I appreciate the thoughts. I've heard you. This is good. But now, hey, it's come back a couple of times. You know, is this something for you? Because I know I've been there when I've shared different advice and definitely shared my fair share of unsolicited advice. And then it's kind of been brought back to me that, oh, actually, you know, I, I didn't see the blind spot in myself. And so I was sharing it to others where I saw it, but that was my perspective. It wasn't their experience, which are two very different things. And so when people kind of share back, like, hey, you know, are you sure? Are you sure it's not for you? <laughs> and oh my gosh. And uh, yeah, there I was, like completely in my own blind spot and in my own way. And that opportunity then actually was not unsolicited advice for someone else. It was advice that was needed for me. Yes. And so uh, you know, that's what we want to kind of navigate and walk through how to 
through these different approaches, providing different ways to support your boundaries while also supporting another and let them know that they're seen, heard, and gotten. Mm -hmm.